Welcome to another BPM Exchange screencast. In this episode, we want to present how BPM Exchange software and expertise may help you in migrating Microsoft Visio based models to event driven process chains and Oracle Business Process Architect. Please note that a companion screencast introduces a corresponding migration to BPMN based Oracle Business Process diagrams. Our showcase is about a typical scenario which we encounter frequently. Many small to medium sized companies and even large ones do have numerous Microsoft Visio based business process models. When such companies wish to migrate their Visio models to a high-end business process platform like Oracle Business Process Architect, the question arises of how this can be achieved in an effective manner. Let's take a closer look at some of the basic facts involved in such migration. In Visio we often just have drawings so that don't follow a process methodology. This is because in normal Visio the modelers are free to design what they want. As a matter of fact, Visio by itself doesn't provide any methodical control. The Oracle Business Process Architect, however, follows strict process methodologies like event-driven process chains or BPMN models. Because of these incompatibilities, there is no direct exchange between Visio and Oracle BPA. Fortunately, BPM Exchange lets you bridge this gap. BPM Exchange acts as a process middleware and allows you to analyze the Visio models and derive a method. Then you map the Visio derived method to the Oracle target method, and finally you convert the Visio models to Oracle BPA. In other words, BPM Exchange lets you start your projects quickly. The agenda of the screencast will be as follows. First, we'll outline the migration scenario from Visio to event-driven process chains in Oracle and explain the necessary steps and BPMX tools involved. In step one of the migration, we'll look at the Visio source models. Next, in step two, we'll show how to obtain a source method from the Visio models. In step three, we'll show how a source method is mapped to an EPC target method. Then in step 4, the actual conversion from Visio to Oracle will be conducted and the result be imported to Oracle BPA. And finally, there will be a summary and discussion of the benefits of the BPMX approach. Let's take a closer look at the steps and BPMX tools involved in the migration from Visio to Oracle BPA, where we wish to employ an EPC target method. In step 1, we'll examine the Visio source models. Step 2 deals with the generation of the Visio source method, which will be derived from the Visio source models. Then, in step 3, we'll create the mapping from the Visio source to the Oracle target method. And finally, in step 4, we'll conduct the conversion from Visio to Oracle and we'll also import the resulting XML file to the Oracle BPA platform. Steps 2 and 3, which deal with the creation of a method and a mapping, involve the BPMX administrator. The administrator is the configuration tool which sits on top of a flexible meta-meta model and allows to create highly customized methods and mappings. In step 4, the BPMX converter comes into play. It is the central process hub which links many business process platforms. In step 1, we'll now look at the Visio source models. We consider a native Visio drawing with two pages, each showing a typical flowchart. By native Visio, we mean a drawing created with normal Visio as opposed to method compliant models created with the BPMX design read in for Visio. In the requisition flowchart, we recognize typical entities like start and end event, rectangles representing process steps, connections between shapes, and swim lanes due to different roles. The process shapes may have shape data like cost duration and resources. These are expected to be transferred to Oracle BPA. Another interesting detail of this flowchart has to do with connections between shapes. Properly glued connections like this one are indicated by small red squares at both ends. This connection, however, has got a green square at its right end, and it's actually not glued to the shape. This would have been impossible with Oracle BPA, but normal Visio doesn't prevent users from doing such things. This fact points out that the quality of Visio diagrams must be kept in mind, but to a certain extent, BPMX is able to deal with imperfect Visio diagrams, as we'll see later. However, it's always a good idea to check the results in Oracle BPA. In the next step, we'll learn how to obtain a source method from the native Visio diagrams. In the BPMX suite, the BPMX administrator is the configuration tool that allows to create and edit methods and mappings. As we wish to create a method from our Visio diagrams, we just consider the Method Editor tab. In the toolbar, we push the Analyzer for Visio button. The Analyzer allows to select a single Visio file as input. As source, we provide the Visio file considered earlier. And in the method path, we need to specify the full name of the method we want to create. For instance, netviz.xmf for native Visio. Now we simply click the Analyze button to obtain the result. The Diagram Types tab shows that we've got one native Visio flowcharts diagram type in the source method. In the Element Types tab, we recognize all Visio master shapes with associated property types and symbols. 
there's only one connection type, Visio's dynamic connector. The Diagram Contents tab finally displays all symbols used for the given diagram type, so we have successfully obtained a source method from our native Visio diagrams. In the following step, we'll see how to map the Visio source method to an EPC target method by a simple metamodel mapping. We now work in the Mapping Editor tab of the BPMX Administrator. In the toolbar, we can see that the open mapping file describes the mapping between the source method netvis.xmf created earlier and an Oracle BPA custom method. And of course, the source format of this mapping is Visio and the target format is Oracle BPA. Most tabs of the Mapping Editor show source method entities on the left and target method entities on the right-hand side. In the Diagram Types tab, the native Visio flowcharts type is mapped to EPC row display in Oracle. The Element Types tab shows that, for instance, a Visio decision is mapped to an Oracle rule element, or a Visio process to an Oracle function element. The Property Types tab reveals that, except for the name property, all Visio properties are mapped to corresponding user-defined attributes in Oracle. The Element-Based Connection Types tab is very useful when dealing with native Visio-based mappings, as connections are typically drawn with a dynamic connector, so connections have no distinct types. This tab allows to define connection types in terms of the connected elements and the target method. This means that if, for instance, an event is connected to a function, then an activates connection will be generated. Or if a function is connected to a rule, then a leads to connection will be created. In this way, the restrictions imposed by Visio's dynamic connector can practically be overcome. Let's now convert our Visio diagrams to Oracle and import the result to Oracle BPA. The user interface of the BPMX converter has a source and a target section to specify the corresponding settings. In the source section, we select Visio as source format. We could convert a complete folder containing many Visio files, but here we just want to convert a single file. And in the Visio options, we tick the Enable Auto Connect feature so that connections that aren't properly glued to shapes will be automatically connected if possible. We pick the native Visio flowcharts.vdx file from the desktop as Visio source file. In the target section, we select Oracle BPA as target format. Then we specify the Oracle XML target file which will contain the conversion result. This will be native Visio flowcharts epc.xml on the desktop. In the Converter's global options, we have to select the appropriate mapping file. This has to be the one introduced earlier when we talked about the mapping. Now we may click the Convert button to run the actual conversion. The resulting XML file has been successfully created on the desktop. Let's move to Oracle BPA to import the conversion result and take a look at the converted models. The import will go into an empty database. We open the context menu for the main group and select Import XML files. Here we pick the XML file that's just been converted and finish the import. As we may see, the requisition model has been properly converted to Oracle. Also, the improperly glued connection in Visio has been created due to the converter's auto-connect feature. Let's quickly consider this function object. The Visio properties cost, duration and resources have been correctly transferred to Oracle. As a result, we realize that native Visio diagrams may successfully be migrated to EPC diagrams in Oracle. As the screencast is drawing to a close, we will now provide a summary and an overview of the benefits you may achieve with BPMAGs. You've seen sample migration scenarios from Microsoft Visio to Oracle Business Process Architect. The essential steps have been the creation of a source method, which was derived from the native Visio diagrams by the BPMAG analyzer for Visio, the mapping of this source method to a target method, and the conversion of the Visio diagrams to Oracle models including the import of the results to Oracle BPA. A BPMAX-based migration provides you with a number of benefits. The migration steps are a consistent and efficient approach to transfer native Visio diagrams to a method-compliant platform. Also, BPMAX utilizes and protects your existing investments. Further benefits are cost savings, particularly when you deal with a large number of Visio diagrams. The automated conversion works fast and saves a lot of manual efforts. In other words, your projects may start quickly. And there's even more you should keep in mind. The migration scenario from Visio to Oracle BPA has served as a useful example, but due to our unique expertise, BPMX is able to support migration scenarios for virtually any source and target platform. The easiest way to contact BPMX will be on our website at www.bpm-ags.com. Please don't hesitate to ask for your free and individual webinar. Thank you very much for your interest and attention.